George Allen grabbed a hold of Virginia's governmental reins in January with the promise of eliminating government waste. A little more than seven months later, there has been a net reduction of 413 state jobs and, according to the administration, a savings of $14 million. But some of those workers are crying foul and suing the Republican governor along with other top state officials. Governor Allen says this type of action just goes with the territory. It's not easy to downsize, and it's, it's not pleasant at all, actually, to have to, to reduce positions because they are individuals, and I can understand how some people get upset. The workers claim they were dismissed illegally. They're challenging a change in state law that expands the number of state employees who can be let go without cause. Whether the claim has any merit or not really is, is up for the courts to decide, and we certainly, I'm certainly trying to follow the law. Governor Allen tells News Channel 6 the threat of lawsuits is not going to stop the administration from working for a more efficient government, whether that's eliminating personnel or any other expenditure. In Richmond, Michelle Mowry, WTVR News Channel 6.